Hi there class, welcome back for Gray. It's really nice that you are once again here and I hope that you are having a nice time staying at home and you are um, enjoying this day. Uh, so today we're gonna keep working on this last unit of the student's book and workbook. Uh, so we might start by doing a review about the activities that we did yesterday at the last video. We did um, activities on students book pages 114 and 115 and they were just reading comprehension activities. That was all that you needed to do. So today we're gonna learn a new topic that you need attention super super well because we're gonna learn how to write a review, uh, writing reviews, etc. Okay, so first of all, what is a review? A review is a text, a paragraph of, for example, someone or something, when you try something, when you read a book, when you watch a movie, when you try a, a dish, when you try some different food, when you go to a place, Sometimes people write a review on the internet and in different places uh, saying their opinion about the book, about the movie, about the restaurant, okay? So are you getting it? So, for example, it's my first time that I'm visiting, I don't know, this Thai food restaurant, okay? It's my first time in there and I need to write a review about this restaurant, okay? Because I want people to know my opinion of this restaurant, if it's good or if my experience was really bad, maybe I want people to know that they shouldn't go to that place. Or if my review is good and my experience was good, maybe I want to share with the people that they should visit this place, right? So for example, I have a review of a uh, Hard Rock Cafe and so there are some parts in here as you can see, this is, uh, maybe this was written in the internet, sometimes a uh, book review, well, m in these days most of the reviews are written in the internet, but pay attention, you can write a review about any object, about any product, about any book, films, uh, food, places, etc. Okay, about anything. So, first of all, I have at Food Fan on November 1st, the best cafe, Hard Rock Cafe, and it said uh, where is located American New Burgers Music Venues. And then you have the location, etc. Okay, Universal City, California. Okay, so it has one, two, three, four from five stars. It was written in November 1st, 2014. And it says, last night we had the best time at dinner that I think I've ever had. Our server, Jessica, was adorable and full of personality plus. She was attentive, entertaining, and knowledgeable. She is such as a set to your restaurant and deserves much kudos. We will definitely be back soon. Was this review useful, funny, cool, etc. Okay? Okay, so this was the review. Now let's pay attention to the structure. Okay? So first of all, we have the online day, online name, and the day. The online name is Food Fan or the day November 1st. The online name user is the user, okay? El usuario, okay? So, the best cafe is the title, okay? The best cafe, okay? And then we have Hard Rock Cafe. Might be the topic sentence, okay? Maybe sometimes the topic sentence is in here, in the body, etc. But you need to differentiate. Pay attention because most of the reviews are different. Uh, maybe they are not in the same order. Maybe they are... Um, in a different structure, but they might have the same parts. Here you can count one, two, three, four, five, and six, okay? You need to have these six parts. Then we have the rating, okay? We have rating five stars. So it means 
is an excellent restaurant because the most that you can have is five stars. Okay, and then we have the body. The body is all your idea, all the message that you want to share with the rest of the customers, etc. Okay, and then we have the final sentence. Y como aquí está todo pegadito en un párrafo, I chose that this is the final sentence. We will definitely be back soon. Okay, so remember, we need to have online name and date, title, topic sentence, rating body and uh, final sentence okay so now let's check the activities that we have in the students book page 116 pay attention to activity 17 because it says read then match the parts of the review okay so we have body of review final sentence online name and date rating title and topic sentence so you can go back and check it in here Okay, so it says review by Toby 23rd on March 15th. Okay, that's the first part. The second part says interesting book for everyone. Then we have the fourth part. No, it's the third part. Yes, it says one, two, three, four, five stars. Okay, then we have Ali and his camera is an interesting book. Okay, that's the fourth part. And then we have the paragraph. It says, I read a book last week and I really like it. It's not a long book. It has 15 pages. There are a lot of great pictures in it. It's about a boy. His name is Ali. He wants a camera. A woman gives him a camera and, ta and he takes pictures. Ali meets a man. The man works at a newspaper. I don't want to tell you much. You should read it for yourself. Okay? So the last part, it says, Ali and his camera is a great book and I recommend it to everyone, okay? So pay attention because you need to record a video reading your own paragraph that you are going to write in exercise 18, okay? So based on this, uh, for example, you can choose something that you have at home, maybe a book, maybe a movie, maybe a video game, maybe a toy, you can choose that and write your own review about it. Les doy a elegir lo que ustedes quieran sobre lo que se quieran basar para escribir su review. Remember, it can be a movie, a video game, just a game, a toy, a book, um, for example, a TV show, etc. Okay, but you need to write your own review following the steps in activity 18. It says, Write a review of a book or a movie you liked. Y aquí yo les, puedo, les voy a dar a elegir de lo que quieran. Ok. Use the text in 17 to help you. Number one. Vamos a ir siguiendo los steps como están aquí. Number one. Think of a book or a movie. Ok. Maybe a place. Number two. Make a list of what you like about it. Ok. Number three. Think of an online game and write today's date, ok, así como está aquí, write a title for your review, ok, like a title like this one, then we have five, think of how many stars to give to the book or movie, plays, video game, etc, anything that you chose to write your review about, number six, write a topic sentence, ok, uh, for example, this is the best um, camera in the book. This is, this is the best camera in the world. This is the best microphone in the world or something like that, okay? Then we have seven. Write two paragraphs of, for the body of the review, like in this one, okay? Two paragraphs, I might say, uh, I bought this microphone like five months ago and it's been really useful for me because I use it to record my videos, I use it for um, my live classes to record my videos, uh, to talk to other people so they can hear me clearly, etc, etc, etc. Explain why you think it is that good or that bad, porque no necesariamente tiene que ser una reseña buena, right? Okay, and in the last, it says, write a final sentence. 
I love this microphone because it's super helpful. Or I love this movie because it's super creative, imaginative, amazing, etc. Okay? So remember, when you finish writing your uh, review, you need to record a video reading your own review from this exercise. Okay? So that's it, kids. I hope to see you tomorrow. Remember that tomorrow we have the Zoom meeting, the live class. And please try to be on time so we can finish and do all the activities that I have planned for you. We are about to finish the Step Inside book and that really makes me super, super happy. So be right there on time at 11 o'clock. I'll see you then. Have a nice and beautiful day. And remember that if you have any questions about anything, you can just send a message to me and of course I will help you. Have a nice day. Bye.